Yo, what up, what up, it's the kid CJ City. You already know what it is, CJ City TV. So we back with another sneaker review. Got everything you need to know about the Bread 13s. But before we get started, gotta let everybody know to subscribe to this channel. Make sure you guys hit that bell right there. Turn on those notifications so you guys can get an email alert every single time I upload brand new sneaker content. With no further ado, let's just talk about it, man. Let's just break these sneakers down. I got the uh, Bread 13s right here for you guys. Comes in your regular uh, Jordan 13 box that they're doing this year kind of taking it back old school with it you know and um yeah man let's just talk about these sneakers right here i'll go ahead and pull them out for you guys so you guys could get a, a close-up you know i will be honest with you guys man um i'm not as excited as most people are when it comes to these bread 13s it's definitely a decent shoe i definitely understand the history i understand the signature jordan wore these sneakers and all that good stuff man but when i actually look at this this model you know i'm just not really that excited i never really was excited about the bread 13s man i don't know why man i'm not here to sway anybody's opinion you know if you love these sneakers hey man keep like yo cj city you tripping i can't wait to get these sneakers that's that's you man but you know i already have a lot of uh black and red shoes i already have the bread 11s i have the bread sixes i have the bread ones um I, I think these are definitely better than the flu games but um yeah man it's basically just a regular 13 man they didn't do anything different here um if you guys are a fan of this sneaker, you're definitely going to love it because, you know, they're not switching up anything on the sneaker. They're giving it to you exactly how it was. So, uh, yeah, man, all the fans of the sneaker are definitely going to be happy. Let's just go ahead and take a look at some of these details right here. You know, bam, let's just take a look at that side right there. Now, we have our all black leather right there, as you guys can see. You know, it is an okay leather. It's not like crazy tumble or anything like that, but it is a decent leather. We have our 3M back on this version right here, guys. So, you know, on the 2013 um, release, they did away with the 3M. I don't know if a lot of people are like me, but I don't like the 3M, man. When you guys are out there in the sun, you know, it just doesn't complement the sneaker. Or when the light hits it, doesn't complement the sneaker. It just kind of gives it like this ray of white or gray lighting on the entire side of your shoe, man. Or if you guys have, you know, like the, um, the altitudes or something like that, you know, it kind of gives off like a brownish or purplish effect or something. It just, it doesn't complement the sneaker. I don't like the 3M. They did away with the 3M on the 2013 but the problem with that was they still left those little white dots in there man so it just it just wasn't crazy man i would love if they just did like an all leather took this tumble leather and made all of this leather kind of like they're doing with the altitude 13s this year i know i know i understand that that's not signature with this sneaker but hey man you guys remember when those flu games came out and they came out in all sway just try something different man we re-released these shoes every single time and they're they're the same every single time so it wouldn't hurt nothing to actually try to switch it up i think that would be better i would love these 13s way better if it was just all leather man that's just me but anyway let's just go ahead and take a look at the flip side right here as you guys could see you know we have more of that 3m on that panel there and then we have the red suede right there man that suede is a pretty decent suede i will say it's not all frizzy not all fuzzy it's not a, a different type of color either Basically, it's the same red that you got on the other ones. You got more of that suede in the back right there as well. And then we also have, you know, that panther eye, you know, on, on the uh, side right there. Hey, man, I can't even front. I've been getting used to those uh, DMP 13s, and I love the fact that it said 9-8 in there with Jordan doing that fadeaway. I love that, man. But we're back to the OG with the 2-3 right there and the Jumpman logo. But uh, yeah, man, basically the same sneaker. Go ahead and take a look at this tongue right here. We have that all suede that's running along the entire tongue there. And that is a nice suede, man. I will say that this is super comfortable, man. You know, oh yeah, the 13s are definitely a comfortable shoe. I will say that as well. But uh, yeah, man, we got our, our red Jumpman there. Like I said, basically the exact same shoe. They ain't really switch up nothing, so it's kind of like a gift and a curse. You know, um, if you are waiting and waiting and waiting for these sneakers, you're going to get exactly what you're looking for. I will say that. But if if you uh like like me, you, you know, you got a, a whole bunch of already black and, and red shoes. This is basically just the same old, same old, man. So uh, you guys can decide 
Are you guys excited about this sneaker? Honestly, I definitely think this sneaker is going to sell out. I don't think it's going to sell out like in 15 minutes in an hour, first day or anything like that. But um, I think it's going to be kind of like those Sequoia 8s, man. Like maybe like within three days, within a week, these are all going to be gone. It's a really classic colorway, really classic sneaker. Everybody can't wait to get their hands on those. So uh, yeah, man, tell me if you guys are planning on copying these sneakers. Tell me, you know, if you guys are like me, do you love the 3M or do you not love the 3M, man? Just drop those comments down below. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel. Until next time, you already know what it is. CJ City, I'm signing off. I appreciate all the love. Peace.